Hello, I'm Candy. Um, if you're here, thank you for watching. I unboxed my FabFitFun and the video was getting really long because I don't know how to edit. So I decided to do my add-ons separately. So this video is going to be my FabFitFun add-ons for the winter box. Um, I have some extra customizations and add-ons. Extra customizations are um, the products that you get to choose from. And um, let's say there's like four things that you get to choose from and you choose the one, but you like the other three, you are given a chance to buy those other three for... Um, what was it this time? Um, $15, $10, and I believe $7. But um, it's, it's a great deal. So, um, one of my extra customizations, because I chose the beanie and the um, arm warmers, I decided to add on the um what was this called where are you at the unhide little marshmallow this retails for 65 dollars and i got this for 15 and this sucker is heavy and i'm so excited i had a hard time deciding should i get this or should i get the other so there's a few things in that first section i, pr I pretty much got everything Except for the candle. Um, oh, open up. It feels so soft and fuzzy. And it's taped up pretty, pretty darn good. Oh, come on. Out of there. Good grief. Whew. It's like a um, cream colored. Oh, man. They got this robe great. And it's so snugly soft. Oh, I'm so glad I got this. Oh, wow. And that's an excellent size. Unhide for love, not fur. I like that. See that? This side is nice. And, um, like silky feeling. And this side is nice, silky feeling and fluffy. I really like this. $65. Wow. And I got it for $15. This is a great blanket. The next item that I got in that same section for $15, and this retail for $65, is the Kate Somerville Goat Milk Moisturizing Clean Cream. Sorry. Save 20% and free shipping. a good coupon. I use um, goat milk soap. I use the Beekman. I love that soap. It is, I recommend Beekman to everybody. It is a great, great soap. And um, I swear by Beekman. Granted, this is Kate Summers, Somerville. It's still goat milk. So when I saw that, I was like, I got to try this. And I also got in that same section. Oh, wow. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I expected these to be a lot bigger. This is the R and Co. Television Perfect Hair Shampoo and Conditioner. Retails for $64. I got them for 15 
but they're 8.5 fluid ounces. $64 for, these are really small. That, that shocks me. I've never, I can't say I've never tried their shampoo and conditioner because I've gotten trials of their um, brand in other subscription boxes, but they, they were little. I just assumed shampoo and conditioner, it'd be like, you know, the regular size bottles, like at least the VO5 size bottle. Uh, $64, I'm, I'm excited to try it. I got it for $15. I'm happy to have it. But for the size, nobody else in this house better use this because I will, that will piss me off because this is very expensive for shampoo and conditioner. And I want it to last and be for me. <laughs> Greedy, I guess, yes. If it was bigger, I'd, I'd say, yeah, use some, but that, no way, $64. I would never, never. 15 is even high, I think, but then I guess it's a good brand. They're safety sealed, so I, I can't even smell it right now. It is what it is. I'm just shocked. I, I think for the price, it you should get a bigger size. That That's just me, but I'm excited to try it. And that is all I picked in that section. For the second um, section, extra customization. I added the um, number two. I added one of the extra items, and that would be these slippers. They are PJ Salvage Fox Trim Cable Slippers. They retail for $45. They look comfortable. They feel comfortable. And I ordered these because I love a good house slipper. Try them on. Forty-five dollars. Wow. My husband bought me some slippers last year for Christmas, and I think he paid twenty dollars. Maybe they were on sale, and um, they have a bottom. That, like, I can wear, I've worn them slippers to work um, before. Very comfortable, and I don't know if I'd be able to do that with these. But we'll see. I mean, for $45, I'm happy with them because I did not pay the $45. But we'll, we'll see. Still a great deal for what I paid. And that was all I chose in that section, extra. In this third section, I added the um, bracelets. Okay, a door. This bracelet retails for $39. A rose gold plated chain and a shining Sikorsky crystal. Okay. I didn't, um, I thought this had Sikorsky crystals going all around. It has one. It's right there. It is still a very pretty bracelet. And this I'm not going to open because this I... Um, got for my granddaughter for Christmas. I think she'll like that. And it's pretty. I thought it had more crystals going around it, but even without that, just having the one, it is is still very pretty. 
And I think I added this for $10, I think it was. I think it, I added it for 10. Um, and that's all I picked in that section. I was going to get that crossbody bag um, that retails for $17.99. That I actually did take the time to look at the size and I took that off because it is like tiny. So I'm glad I did not get that. But I did add it retails for $27.95. I did order the Paper Source 12 Month Rose Floor Floral Planner. And this is very pretty. I bought this because I started a um, business. I have a small cleaning company. I do that during the day and um, at night I manage a um, Snowco gas station. But being that I have started my business, um, hopefully it will grow. Um, I decided to get the calendar. And I like that. It's got, um, it's for 2020. It's got every month. In the back it has notes. A note section. I'm very happy with that. 2020 it says on the front. So I'm hoping this will help me um, stay organized with scheduling the um, houses and apartments that I already clean and um, hopefully I'll get to add on some more and grow. That is my, my, um, my goal for the new year is to grow my business, eventually being able to hire um, employees and going from there. So I'm excited to have that. And I believe I added this for $7, if I'm not mistaken. I'm trying to see if there was anything else. Everything else I think I just added. So that's my extra customizations. And this stuff here is what I got in the add-ons. And I it um, it has my my bill like what I got, but it doesn't um, have on here what I paid. And I honestly don't remember. But um, everything I got was a fraction of the price it cost at retail. The first thing I'm going to pull out. So I had to have it is the um, winter 2019 collectible tote by Fafit Fun. I think this was nine dollars if I remember correctly. But I figured this with my bill book and my planner and things like that my business cards this would be perfect starting the new year and it's plenty of space in there it has a little pocket it has a snap it has the um, handles that you can carry it like that or like this and then it has this 
that you can make bigger and toss it over like a crossbody. And I like the design is the same as on the box. I love that. I'm glad I got that. Usually, the, when every time these are sold out, so um, for each season, so I'm glad I got this. And um, I'm going to use it for business, so I'm excited about that. I'm going to stick my planner in that little bag. That's my business bag. I'm excited for that. The next item I got is the Daily Concepts Your Body Towel Wrap. And this is a towel, so you get out of the shower, you wrap yourself around it. Or wrap yourself around it. Good grief, Candy. You wrap this around your body. <laughs> so I got that. I got a um, Corez Black Pine 3D Sculpting and Firming Sleeping Oil. 3D Intensive Firming and Nourishing. I'm forever on the hunt for a product that will help with all the looseness, the wrinkles, the pores. Um, Corez is a great um, brand. So when I saw this, I decided I would give it a try and see how it works. Hopefully, it does what it needs to do. The next item, which I was very happy to get because I've heard great things about African botanicals. Um, again, that's a product that um, is usually sold out or I don't have the money to get it at the time. This is the... Um, and they have different, they come out with different things. Like, it'd be the African Botanicals uh, Face Lotion or whatever. This time, it was the Res Resurrection Cell Recovery Serum. It's supposed to be hydrating serum to help brighten, increase collagen, lift firm the skin and reduce fine lines while soothing and restoring balance to all skin types. It's an expensive, expensive um, cream. So I, I think this was the most expensive thing I got. I think it was like 20 something. It looks like that. And I'm not going to open it just yet until I'm ready to use it. I'm excited to try that. Some of these skincare items in the hundreds, it's crazy. So to be able to get a great product for 20 something bucks, can't beat it. The next item I purchased is the Daily Concepts um, sponge. It comes with a little holder. Last time I bought the charcoal one. Loved it. Worked really great. Now I will have this one. This is great for um, when I wash my face. This helps with exfoliating. So I'm happy that I got this. And I think this was like five bucks. The next product I bought, what is this? This is in bubbly wrap, wait do you, which is good, but wait do you see what I got that I feel should have been in bubbly wrap and just wasn't, just tossed in the box. But that is what it is. This is the mint, pear, fresh, cucumber, and Witch Hazel Facial Toner. I'm excited to try that. A good toner. And I, the packaging is very pretty. Feels really, really nice. 
the next product I'm pulling out is the Tea Tree Triple Tree Invigorating Shampoo for All Hair Types. This shampoo I got for free because I spent over a certain amount and I got to pick a free item, so I chose this. I bought the um, Line in Define Laura Geller Dual Dimension Eyeliner. It's a liquid eyeliner and a coal eyeliner. I like Laura Geller products, so getting to get one of these and try the um, eyeliner was great for me. Line and Define Dual Dimension Eyeliner, Black Platinum. It looks like that. Oh, it twists off. No. This is the one side. And this is the other side. I um platinum coal eyeliner, black liquid eyeliner. So this is the platinum coal. I'm gonna have to um read the um instructions and maybe Google on how to use this. Because <laughs> I I don't have a clue. I know how to use eyeliner in general. I am not good at putting it on. I'm still trying to learn how to do that because it, it just never comes out looking right. So I'll Google um, how to actually use this product. The next product I bought was the Laura Geller Nude Attitude Multi-Finish Eyeshadow Palette. This is the first Laura Geller palette I have ever had. and gotten to purchase and I got to do so at a very reasonable price and it has a beautiful mirror and beautiful colors wow I'm excited for that 12 eyeshadows so I'm excited to dip into that don't have time in this video but I've been told her products are great, so I'm excited for that. I got the um, Laura Geller Montauk Escape Face Palette. Another great buy. This also comes with a mirror. And it has a um, four eyeshadows in the middle a blush and a I believe bronzer summer solstice and vitamin C so I'm excited about that yeah these are the products I would think would have been in bubble wrap but um, they were just in the box so I'm glad these two things didn't break because I'm sure they bounced around during shipping. I got the Express Yourself Eyeshadow Palette made with coffee extract. Darn it. This video is going to be long. I'm so sorry. And this is actually in, in a wrap. Express yourself. It's pretty. I like how it's gold around. Beautiful mirror. Oh, wow. A lot of pretty colors. Very pretty colors. 
in another palette that I got at a, an, a great price. I got the Tardiest Pro High Performance Naturals. Um, this was actually, this palette was actually, um, referred to me by Tarte when I got on their side and answered their questionnaire. It gives you, um, examples of how to use it. I filled it all out and they actually suggested this palette to me. Looks like that. The back is very shiny and pretty. Very big, pretty mirror. Um, but at the time, I did not get this because I was seeking out a different palette. Those are very, very pretty colors. Smells really nice. I love Tarte products. Love it. So when I saw this, I, I grabbed it. I couldn't resist. <laughs> and my last add-on, another palette. It did come in the bubble wrap. Hip Dot. Looks like that. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, that's pretty. And it's nice and thick. Wow, I love these colors. It's got a great mirror and these colors, OMG. I am excited, look at that. Wow, my lighting does not do these justice. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I'm very happy with this. I have never heard of this company. I am definitely going to um, look them up. Zion Pressed Eyeshadow Palette. Just one look at Utah's sandstone caves will transport you to a world of majestic beauty. Connect with these sweeping canyons through the Dramatic reds, deep oranges, and rich purples of Zion. Hipdot.com. Definitely going to um, check this out. Check out the company. Um, because this is just gorgeous. Gorgeous. I love Tarte. I've used Tarte many, many a times. I love them. Um, so I know how that's going to work. The um, Beauty Corp, croup, the, the Beauty Croup, Crop, Croup, whatever. I've never tried them before, so I'm excited about that. Laura Geller, um, I have heard is wonderful. Um, great brand. If I'm not mistaken, she originated... Um, the first primer, if I'm not mistaken, I think that was Laura Geller. Might be wrong, but if she has, if she's the one that does the spackle, then yes. So I'm excited to um, try that and use her product as far as the eyeshadows go. I do have a lipstick from Laura Geller. Love it. Um, but at any rate, I'm sorry this video is so long. These were my extra customizations and my add-ons for Five Fit Fun this season. And I'm very happy with everything. Um, a little iffy about the shampoo and conditioner. I mean, the bottle's not even all the way full. I mean, it, it's right here. They're, they could build it all the way for the price. They're $64 retail. I paid 15 but still, I mean, wow. I'm, I'm not used to paying that kind of money for shampoo and conditioner. So, But for 15 I still think that's high, but I'm glad to have it. 
and the house slippers. Um, they retail, what was it, like 50 bucks, $45 or something it said. Yes, they're pretty. They're made by PJ Salvage, so maybe it's because of the name. But um, I just, I think they, I don't know, they could have been more of like a, you could wear them type anywhere type thing for that price. But they look pretty. They feel comfortable. They are very well made. Um, other than that, um, I'm happy with everything. I can't wait to get in and, and play with everything and use everything. I don't have a favorite because I'm excited for everything that I was able to get. So. Um, with that being said, have a great evening. If you made it through this video, thank you very much. Um, even a few minutes watching, it helps. Um, I'm learning as I go, and I'm enjoying this. So, you guys have a great evening, and thank you for stopping by. Bye.